There are several methods you can use to quantify left ventricular ejection fraction, or LVEF, but in the context of most cardiac POCUS exams, visual estimation is considered to be a reliable method of classifying LV systolic function into one of three buckets. Normal, which implies an LVEF of greater than 50%, moderately reduced systolic function, or moderate systolic dysfunction, which is typically considered to be an LVEF between 30 and 50%, and severely reduced systolic function or severe systolic dysfunction, which typically implies an LVEF of less than 30%. These three clips show representative images of each bucket in the peristernal long axis view. In this view, you should look for fractional shortening or the relative change in the anterior-posterior dimension of the LV chamber, though be careful to judge this using the endocardial borders rather than the myocardium or pericardial border as these structures are much more eye-catching but can be misleading. Another structure that can add data to your gestalt is the movement of the anterior mitral valve leaflet, seen here, which will typically open more vigorously in a heart that has better systolic and diastolic function. Quantifying this movement will be the subject of a future video.